that's to get those glutes extra warm. All right, from here, make sure your knees are forward a little bit. Use the edge of your shoes to kind of pivot on, and then you can kind of go full Jane Fonda if you want. Just put your head down. Good, now notice I want to lock my hip in, okay? So I don't want to let my hip rock back. I want to just open the knees as much as the glute will contract to pull so versus rocking that hip to get extra distance. Good. Let's go four, three, total of 10 each side, two, last one. Beautiful. All right. Style points for switching sides on the mat. You see it's on my first rodeo. Get soles of feet together, pin the hip, and you might notice a difference side to side. Nine, eight, that left side, just seven, six, doesn't love it, five, four, three, two, and one. Lovely job. Last set. We're going to do a forward monster walk. So I want you to imagine you're skating, okay? So I want you to push past your mat and then nice and wide. Past my mat, nice and wide. Past my mat, nice and wide. Let's go back. So really keep the hips pushing backwards as you step. Excellent. Again, push, push, push. Good. This glute should be nice and warm by now. Good. One more lap. Using that mat sort of as a guide of how wide you can stretch those legs. If your band is really heavy, you know, Godspeed to you. <laughs> Might be a little bit more uncomfortable than mine is, but hey, we work with what we can work with. I lied to you. I said one more lap, but like, it's so good. This will be the last one. Top of the mat, and band can go off. Nicely done. Okay. Time to grab your equipment, get your uh, water bottles, whatever you need to do, tie your shoelace again, because elementary school was a long time ago. Clearly, I did a terrible job of this in the first place. All right, clock is on, team. We're going 45 seconds on, 15 seconds off, okay? The classic, but with the first movement, I want you to go slow, 